Good morning loves, so I'm back with another what I wore in a week. It's Monday today and it's very dark outside, hence why I've got the box light on, just to give it a bit of light in my room because it's so dark. But today I've got a really lovely day planned actually, which is very abnormal for a Monday. It's a very bougie day. Me and Alice, who is a fellow content creator and a lovely friend of mine, and we've got a few PR appointments. So we're meeting with La Labo, the perfume. It's my favorite perfume brand. I wear another 13 every day and then swap it up with Santal as well. And then we've actually got a PR lunch at the opening of Sexy Fish in Manchester. And it's very fancy, so I thought I'd take you along with us and just show you what it's like inside and the food and drink options as well so I'm actually off to get my nails done as well so this is a very usually on a Monday I'm at my desk by now in my joggers working away but this is quite a nice way to spend a rainy Monday so yeah it's absolutely tipping it down in Manchester so I've gone for this look today so I thought I'd pop on my vintage leather trench to stay dry I've got my cashmere roll neck on which is going to keep me lovely and warm I've not gone with too many layers because we're going to browse the shops after and I don't want to be super hot so that's why I've gone for these and then I've got my Arquette belt on my I've gone for my Topshop jeans today actually just because they seem to fit a little bit better with these boots they sit slightly more cropped and a bit higher so it really shows off the boots nicely and I've gone for my flattered boots today which as I've said before a great dupe of the row I actually wore this last year when the weather wasn't great so I'm just recreating it really so I've just added my grey knit over my shoulders and just in case it gets colder later I can pop it on and then I've gone with my Pelen bag again today so yeah that is the final look Look. and this outfit is really great for those rainy days you've got your leather boots to match with your leather trench your comfy jeans a really nice warm roll neck and then an extra layer if you need it I'll take you with me I'll do a little bit of vlogging today if I can hopefully the rain stops um but yeah I will see you guys later <laughs> Tuesday and happy Halloween. I'm channeling all the Morticia Adam vibes today. I blooming love Halloween so I've gone with all the black accessories. I've got my Monica Vinader earrings in and my ring as well. And I've gone for this Monica Vinader necklace because it fits perfectly around this neckline and I wore this outfit to an event a couple weeks ago and I really loved how it looked so I'm recreating it again today for Halloween and I love this jumper it's a great one to dress up and down as well I'll come close so you can see the texture it's in this lovely boucle um, knit texture it also comes in a neutral as well if you fancy it in that I love the flared sleeve it's a really nice oversized fit and then I've teamed it with my satin midi skirt and my knee-high boots today as well. So the plan for today is just working at home and then me and Lee are having a little Halloween-y date night. We love Halloween. So we're going to be carving some pumpkins, having a little date night dinner and watch a scary film. It's the only time of year I can get Lee to watch a scary as well. So that's what we're doing. Oh, yesterday I forgot to vlog the Lalabo appointment, but I wanted to talk to you about their new perfume because it's beautiful. So it's this one here and it's Lavande 31, which obviously lavender comes to mind but it doesn't smell like how you would think a lavender perfume to smell it's so gorgeous it's very fresh and a little bit dirty which i would describe all the labo scents they're very dirty very sexy very musky and this scent is that with a hint of lavender as well it's also got bergamot neroli and oak moss in I've actually got it on today and it's not usually a scent that I would wear. I wouldn't usually go for the lavender tones, but because it's Lalabo, the way they've mixed the scents is just perfection. So 
yes, you'll have to get a little sample, give it a go and let me know if you like it. I also need to pop out today as well, so I'll pop on a coat now and show you what I'm wearing to head out. So I've gone for my mango sheeling coat today. It's finally stopped raining, so I thought, why not get the wool coats and fur coats out? And this is so cosy. It does feel really cold today. Um, I can't believe it's the 1st of November tomorrow. It's crazy. And I'm very excited to get the cosy coats out. I would wear this outfit in the evening as well. So I'd pop on a red lip, maybe my hair in a scrunchie, put on some higher boots, and then you'd be ready to go. But equally, it's perfect for the day too. And I'm very excited to recreate this look as well as we go in to the festive season. Definitely with a pop of red and some more glam makeup. So yeah, that is Tuesday's cosy look for Halloween. So I'll see you all tomorrow for Wednesday's look. Hello loves, it is Wednesday today and I'm working from home today. So I've got a lovely cosy co-ord on. This one is from Sansia and I love them as a brand. You guys will have seen me feature a lot of their products on my channel and this is a lovely new addition. The perfect length trousers to chill in as well. And I love that they can be worn on their own or you can wear them as separates too. In this lovely neutral rib knit and I love the contrast of the collar, the placket and on the cuffs as well. You've also got it on the hem of the trousers and on the waistband. No makeup day today because I needed a break and I'm actually going to an event tonight so I thought I'd save the hair and makeup for when I get ready. I think I'm gonna go all black with a pop of red because for this time of year I love wearing a red lip and I've got a really cute little red bag that I might wear or I'm gonna do brown and red. This event is actually with another perfume brand called Initio and their scents are beautiful. So I'm really excited and it's at one of my favorite restaurants in Manchester, it's at Kitten. So if you've never been or if you're visiting Manchester, I'd highly recommend going. It's gonna be really nice. I've not been to like a dinner event for so long and they're usually quite a lot of them this time of year. So it'll be really nice to see some of the Manchester girls and just catch up with them all really. I'm gonna crack on with some work and I will see you a little bit later for my evening look. So I'm back and looking a little bit more glam than before. And this is tonight's outfit. So I've gone head to toe brown with a pop of red. I just think red looks fab with brown and it's something a little bit different to black as well. So I'll start with the top. I've gone for my Monica Vinader Neura earrings. You'll have seen me feature these quite a lot in recent videos. Then I've gone for a red lip to match this lovely red bag. This is from Anthropology, and it's such a good Bottega dupe. I love it. And it's the perfect shade of red to style with all my party outfits as well, and on the daily too, if you want a pop of red in your outfit. And then this stunning top is from Dagmar. I've actually got this in green as well like a sage green for the summer. So I feel like this is the perfect winter version. And then these trousers are from Arquette. And honestly, they fit so well, but they sit really nice and high-waisted, super comfortable. So I can't wait to style these for the daytime as well. And then I've actually popped on my croc boots from Dear Francis because they go so well with these trousers. They're the perfect height and they're gonna keep my legs nice and warm. So yeah, that is tonight's evening look. I just love this shade of red with this chocolate brown. I just think it adds a great pop to a minimal outfit. So I'm gonna be styling this bag a lot for party season. Anyway, I best go because I'm gonna be late otherwise. I forgot to show you my coat that I'm taking with me as well. So I've just thrown on my old H&M wool coat because it matches perfectly and it's gonna keep me really nice and warm as well. So there, honestly, I wish I could go out in just this bardo top, but it's absolutely freezing, so a wool coat is needed. But yeah, I will see you all at Kitten. Hi loves, it's Thursday today, and I'm back with a very casual outfit for today. A big contrast from yesterday's evening look. I had such a nice evening and I'm really sorry I didn't vlog it. I was just kind of like in the moment and just completely forgot to vlog. So I was too busy chatting away to the brand and the lovely Manchester girls that I've not seen for ages. So yeah, I had a lovely evening. And yeah, as you can tell, because I've been talking so much, my voice is gone. <laughs> so yeah, that's what you get for talking for like five hours. But it's four o'clock and it's so dark outside, I can't believe it. 
and I'm just waiting for Lee to come home and my dad's coming around because it's his birthday. So we're going to take him to our local for a birthday tea. So I've just gone very casual for the pub. I've got my long sleeve tea on from Arquette, my bag from Cos and this is my lovely new jacket from Cos as well. I love this shade of like top brown it's really nice and oversized so this is actually an extra small but it fits all my chunky knitwear underneath as well which i love and then i've got my arquette belt my everlane jeans and my leather converse and then i'm going to pop on my new hat which i'm going to show you now as you can probably tell i'm loving red at the moment and this is a new ganny hat that i've added to my wardrobe i do have a neutral one but i just love this poppy red color to add a pop of color to my neutral outfits and I actually got this from Vinted brand new second hand um, for half the price so I was so chuffed if I find any more on Vinted I'll link them below and I'll also link this hat to the Ganny site anyway it's just so cozy and because we're walking to the pub I thought I'd pop a hat on to keep me nice and warm so that is today's outfit I actually wore this look last week as well when we went for a walk and I got so many lovely compliments on my hat as I said on my video yesterday, I just love adding in a pop of red with my accessories because it really does lift your neutral outfits. And if you're having a gloomy day like we are in Manchester, it really does brighten the day up. So yeah, that is today's cosy look from me. I will see you guys tomorrow with Friday's look. Hello loves and happy Friday. So today hasn't quite gone to plan. So me and Alice were supposed to shoot today, but the weather... It's just awful, it's been raining all day. So I've just been editing from home today and this is today's look. I wanted to show you these trousers dressed down as well because as you saw earlier on in the week, that's how I'd style them for the evening. But I wanted to show you how easy it was to dress them down as well. I mean, there's so many different ways you can style these trousers anyway, which I'll certainly feature throughout my future videos. But I've gone today with my cream Arquette tee my black cardigan with these lovely black and brown buttons on this one is from finery this really cute bag from a cloud i'm obsessed with this bag this is a new addition in my collection and it's got a very vintage feel to it which i love and then look at the clasp it's a tiny little cloud i love it it's so cute and then I've gone for my brown trousers again and popped this under the stories bell on and then finished the look with my sambas because they've got a little bit of black and brown on as well so I thought I'd pop those with these and as you can see they don't drag on the floor which is a real winner so I can wear these trousers for the day and the evening too. This is it with the trench thrown on top too. So yeah I popped out earlier to the post office and took my brolly as well because it was tipping it down. This is how I'd style it out and about in the city as well. Or if it was colder, I'd probably pop on my top wool coat or my cream dish one. So that's a very smart casual look from me today for a Friday. What I'm actually gonna do now is get changed into my joggers. I'll keep the cardi and tea on because we're just chilling tonight. I feel like I've had a really busy week as well as the evenings. So I'm feeling a little bit run down. So yeah, just want a nice quiet one tonight. I've just changed my mind last minute. I've actually popped on these lovely wool blend knitted trousers. These are also from Finery and they are so soft and warm and they go really nicely with this cardigan too. So that's a very simple Friday evening look from me. I am gonna go and chill now. Hey loves, happy Saturday. So today I'm off to my friend's house and we're just having a little girl's day at hers. So I've gone for a very casual, cozy outfit today. I've got my white tee on, my necklace from Monica Vinada, my Majuri earrings, my Monica Vinada ring, this gorgeous knit from Beaufort and Blake. It's a merino wool blend, so it's beautiful to wear. And I love the chunky knit stitching and the wide hem and cuff as well. I just think it is so gorgeous and it's gonna be one of those timeless pieces in my wardrobe that I'll reach for um, year after year. I'm really excited to style this with a few different trousers as well. I feel like this would look gorgeous with brown. But today I've gone with my comfy jogger wide legs that I always reach for when either working from home or I just want to be really comfy. So these are great for just chilling in. And then I've paired them with my sambas. 
So a very cozy outfit for today. It's not the best weather outside, so we just wanted to kind of like hunker down, stay indoors and have a cute little girls day. And then I'm gonna take my flattered bag with me as well. I love adding in these tan tones with the gray as well. That is Saturday's very cozy outfit. I really love this. I love the warm tones in it. And I love how the pop of gray on the sambas pairs with this lovely cardigan. I will see you all tomorrow for Sundays. Hello loves, happy Sunday. So today me and Lee are heading out for a little wander. We're going to go to the supermarket, pick up some things for a roast and yeah enjoy the sunshine. It's actually in and out sunshine today which I'm really happy about. It's pretty chilly today so I've gone for lots of layers. So I've gone for navy up top and I've got this lovely vest on from Beaufort and Blake. The same brand that I had on yesterday, the grey cardigan. And it's a little vest so I've just popped my shirt underneath um, just so it pops out at the bottom you know and breaks up the blue a little bit. And then I've got my Helen bag, my Mo & Co jeans on and I've actually gone for my Uggs today. This is the first time I've got them out. I usually leave them for right into the winter months but I want it to be really cosy today and just everything oversized and snug and I really enjoy styling navy and tan around this time of year. And another reason why I've got the Uggs out is because for once this week it's actually dry so I can make the most of wearing them. I might actually wear my neutral Ganny hat as well today. Let me pop it on actually and um, I'll show you, see what we think. I think I'm going to go with the hat because I just love this knit. I was actually going to pop my red one on but I might stick to the neutral. I fancy staying neutral today. So yeah, that is a very cosy look for a Sunday wonder. I'm so excited to have a roast later. I've not had one for ages and I just feel like this weather's like the perfect roast weather so... Yeah, we're going to make one. Say we, Lee is going to make one. <laughs> He's so much better at cooking than me. Anyway, I'm going to go and enjoy this lovely weather. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was really nice to just have a more relaxed kind of vlog style. And just show you some of the outfits that I've been wearing this week, really. So yeah, I'll link everything below as always. And I'll see you all very, very soon.